Hey guys, Ali Entertainment, and guess what day is the week it is? It is e-blog day, and I do know that I forgot it last week. I am so, so sorry. I have been so busy, and right now, as I'm filming this, I'm tired. It's been a long day for me, and I'm ready to hit the hay, but I was like, you know what? No, I gotta get this up. I gotta get this up. Uh, so a few things happened, you guys. If you don't know, Prince William and Princess Kate had their baby, uh, little Charlotte Diane something. Anyway, she's so completely adorable, and I watched uh, part of the news, and I got to see I got to see them leaving the hospital. It was so cute. If you guys want to catch up on that or watch the news, just just look up Prince William and Kate or Princess Charlotte. I think that's a cute name, actually. Um, out of all of them, I thought that Charlotte was definitely. Oh, it's you know what? It's Charlotte. Elizabeth Diane? I don't know. I'm Anyway, I'm kind of blabbering on about that. So, yay, congratulations to the couple. So cute. Oh, my God. Okay, and here are some other news that popped up. I don't know why he fascinates me so much. It just seems like, well, he doesn't really fascinate me. I kind of hate him, but um, he's always in the news. Kanye West. Like, seriously. So, apparently, he just graduated and got his doctorate in some performing arts or something, so, uh, yay, Kanye, yay, another thing to brag about, oh my god, he drives me absolutely insane, um, also, if you guys haven't heard the bad news, one of the voices of The Simpsons, Harry Shearer, um, decided to leave and if you guys don't know who he is he played well he was the voice for three characters he was the voice for mr burns ned flanders and principal skinner so i'm not too sure how they're gonna go about if they're gonna get um another voice because you can't you can't write off those three characters i mean they're not like the main simpsons characters but the simpsons wouldn't be wouldn't be without him, like, especially Mr. Burns and Ned Flanders, there is absolutely, I, I, I don't know what they would do. And if you guys didn't hear, somebody beeped me on Facebook, which is kind of annoying, I didn't turn it off, so somebody sent me a message, and not to mention my dog is bugging to get out of the door, but he's just going to have to wait a few minutes. So, if you guys seen today, they released a new trailer, and there goes another beep. Um, they released, released a new trailer, uh, DC's Legends of Tomorrow. So, this is going to be on CW TV. Um, so, it's kind of like a mixture of um, the Flash and Arrow kind of crossover. But they also have Red Canary... Hawk Girl, um, Adam, Mr. Freeze, and Heat Wave, something like that. Anyway, it looks so friggin' awesome. I can't wait to watch it. I'm not too sure if it's coming in the summertime or if it's gonna come in the fall, but I guess we will find out. And another thing, these coming weeks, you guys, if you watch you know, the flasher arrows, they are coming to an end, so I am pretty sad, because I freaking am loving the flash, absolutely loving the flash, and I got to meet one of the characters in it, uh, Firestorm, I mean, he wasn't, like, a main character, but, um, he is also gonna be in that new TV show that I just announced, so I'm, I'm freaking so excited to see him, because he's so freaking adorable. And when I got to meet him, if you guys didn't know that um, all that stuff is filmed in Vancouver, British Columbia, Columbia, and I live in British Columbia as well. I'm about 12 hours away, but it's so cool. So if I really wanted to, I can just drive down there and maybe see the set and maybe meet some celebrities. Wouldn't that be freaking cool? freaking awesome. Anyway, I'm just in an odd mood tonight. Odd mood tonight. I just actually recently got back from the movie theater and guess what I saw? I watched Pitch Perfect 2. So when I saw the previews, 
I got so damn excited because I loved the first one, so I'm like, I have to go see it. So it was on for preview night, and I was like, you know what? <laughs> I'm going to go watch. I'm getting a lot of distractions right now. My cat is meowing right now. Oh, my God. So anyway, you guys, if you want to know more about the movie, check out my movie review. I'm hopefully going to have it out on Sunday or Monday, but who knows? I might be dead tired from work, so... Um, I guess we will just play it by ear. Um, oh, and I am watching a new TV show on Netflix, you guys. Don't laugh at me. I was just bored, and it kept, it's been popping up for months. So I watched this TV show called Mako Mermaids. I, it's, it's a teen kind of thing from, uh, New Zealand. And I am a complete dork for watching it, but I just been binge-watched it in, like, three days on my days off. Um, I know, very productive days off when I could have been making like videos or anything like that. I watched Mako Mermaids and I enjoy it. Some of it is so funny watching them swim in that fake fish tail. <laughs> and of course, I'm still watching Third Rock from the Sun. Friggin' funny as hell. I, I, I can't get enough of it. I don't know why I didn't watch it when I, um, when it was on TV. But then again, I think I was 11 when it came out, and I don't think it was the most appropriate show for me to watch when I was 11. Um, anyway, tonight I'm just kind of rambling on, so I'm going to sign out for now, you guys. Um, stay tuned for next week. I will have, again, movie review, something uh, from the Calgary Expo, another e-blog. So I guess we'll find out what's going on in the entertainment world or in my world. Anyway, you guys, don't forget to like and subscribe down below. You guys have yourself a great night.